You know, another thing that you write about in the book, and I was so glad to see this on Chapter 7, where you talk about Black Lives Matter. Black Lives Matter accuse whites of not valuing black lives. In your book, you say Black Lives Matter less to Black Lives Matter than lies and leftist politics. I'm glad you wrote about them because a lot of black young people believe that Black Lives Matter is a good and needed organization for black people. <laughs> no, no, they're not. You know, sometimes we're our own worst enemy. Again, there's one of those lightning rods that I touch that I talk about, yes. that self-examination in the, in the uh, black community. Look at the, the crime numbers. Blacks are over-victimized in terms of their representation in the, the population at large. They tend to be the, the victims of violence. You know who tends to be the suspects? Overwhelmingly, black people. Yeah. There's an example of we're our own worst enemies. You never hear Black Lives Matter talk about that. All they talk about are the few instances, and they're anomalies, and I'm not trying to justify the few instances of, of police use of force or police behavior that happens in the black community. Fortunately, it's an anomaly, but they just whistle past the graveyard when it comes to the black on black crime. Yeah. 4,000 people were shot in the great city of Chicago in 2016. 4,000. That is a sin before God, and they said nothing about that. And the overwhelming majority of those people that were shot were black, and the perpetrators were black. The same with the homicide rate in Chicago. And it's not just Chicago. You look at Milwaukee, you look at yeah. Baltimore, you look at any city uh, you know, that is the American ghetto, and you're going to see the same thing. Black Lives Matter should have been protesting, not Donald Trump campaign rallies. They should have been protesting in front of Mayor Rahm Emanuel's office in 2016, demanding a plan of action to reduce the violence. Yeah. They should have been protesting at every abortion clinic, Planned Parenthood clinic in America. Planned Parenthood kills more black babies than any other demographic. And I believe the year was 2012. In the, in the city of New York, more black babies were aborted by Planned Parenthood than were born. So when, when I hear about Black Lives Matter and I hear this group, they're a fraud. Yes. Uh, they can get your book in any major bookstore, Amazon.com or anywhere, right? Yes, it's doing well. Uh, it's a great read. I don't say that because, you know, I was involved in it. But again, you know, I, I touch those things that most people in positions of leadership are afraid to talk about. Yeah. And the object is to inspire others everybody to stand up, you know, in this, in this effort to make America great again and to move America forward, to have the courage to not only engage in debate and dialogue on these things, because we may not come to an agreement, but that's why the subtitle says beyond hashtags of race, crime and politics. We need to get beyond some of this stuff. And the tendency is we get stuck in it. We get yeah. stuck on issues of race instead of beyond it.